Hey guys, this is Brandy, otherwise known as Mystery of Diamonds, and welcome to my channel. If you're new here, hey y'all. Okay, so as you can see, my nails don't kind of match. I have two paintings that I want to unbox, and they have similar themes as far as what they are. So I'm kind of calling this my fire and ice nails okay and so like maybe once you see both paintings you'll understand where i'm going with this um so i kind of mixed and matched some of the nails that i have to be able to kind of go with these so i'm going to start and both of these come from if you can see it crystal canvas art designs I absolutely, positively love this company. Amy has amazing things. So, I'm going to open this box ah, first, if I don't <coughs> mess anything up. So, when she had stuff on her site, I saw these and instantly flipped my lid. Y'all, I lost my cookies. They went out the window. Yeah, mm -hmm. I had, I had, okay, see, it's one of those things I had to have, absolutely had to have. So, <laughs> what I'm going to do is I'm going to unroll it, and then I'm going to roll it the other way because this is poured glue, okay? And so, you can do this with poured glue. Real quick, before I do, this is the toolkit. So, it comes with a green boat, some baggies, a pink pen, and a pair of silver tweezers. Okay, so I'm going to set this to the side. I am going to roll this back the other way. Okay, are y'all ready to see the first image? Oh my God. Whew, I'm so excited. Here we go. Boom. Oh, and it's upside down. Oh my gosh, I boomed upside down. <laughs> oh, look at him. Oh my gosh. I know you can't see the entire image. Okay, let's put you guys to the side. I'm going to put you to the side. Okay. So, look at his horns. And look. Okay, so it's not like you only get, like, you get the head. And he comes down here. And here's his breastplate and all that. But you can see, uh, the reason I call him, like, an ice dragon is i mean look at all this beautiful blue right and you do have pops of like pinkish red and whatnot this is a 40 by 70 uh and it's got how many colors 28 colors oh my gosh and the legend let's see if i can get you to see the legend here the legend are numbers and letters okay there's no symbols and let's see if I can get you down into whoa hello come on plastic work with me do not don't you dare tear no no sir sorry sometimes I talk to my stuff because I'm hoping it'll listen to me <laughs> all right so I'm gonna bring you down into the drill field give me just a minute okay so let's look at these symbols wow I mean, they look clear to me. One of the things I'm looking for, because see, I see, I see this Q, okay? And so I'm just looking to make sure there's not like a, an O, you know, because Q and O can look similar, but I don't see an O, okay? Let me see, are there any others? Okay, so E and F are both on here. Um, let me see if I can find some of the E and F. Well, hmm, I don't see any in this first part. Where's the E and the F? E and F? Okay, so, well, okay, it's farther on down the painting, so we'll just have to, there, let's see if I can, so E, E is this lighter color and F is this darker. So I don't think it's going to be that much of an issue. Um, so I think it should be okay. 
but I mean, these symbols are very clear. Can y'all see that? And there's no guide circles. And if you don't know what a guide circle is, it's like this circle, this dark um, or this black circle that goes around the letter um, or number. And this does not have it. And sticky. Yep. Ooh. <laughs> it's sticky. All right. Let me bring you back up. Okay. So the next thing I want to do is I want to check and see. Oh, I got a bubble. Not in the not in the glue. Just in the plastic. Um, but I want to see if this is a true 40 by 70. So let us get our trusty tape measure here. And let us see. Oh, it is 40. All right, let's turn this bad boy. Well, hold on. If I can not knock myself out in the process. <laughs> All right, and let's see if we can figure out if it is 70. If it's 40, it should be, it should be 70. Yep, and it is 70. So this is true to size. This is a true, and so here, look, you can kind of see it to the side. Look at that baby. Oh, my, okay, it's not a baby. It's a beautiful, beautiful man. He's not a baby. He's a man. You don't like me calling him baby. Okay, so, and usually when I have my unboxings of dragons, I have to have my little dragon egg out because his name, for those of you who are new, this is Egbert. And Egbert is a little baby dragon, and so he likes to tend to be out here whenever I have dragons. Um, and so this is a crystal painting. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to turn this over. Uh-oh, did something come out? No, okay, that was just from before. <laughs> All right, I'm going to turn this over, and I'm going to kind of lay out the palette um, so that y'all can see the colors, okay? Um, and then I'll be right back. Okay, so look at these colors. Now, y'all, look at this. This this is a lot of one color. And if I'm correct, this is the black, okay? Which the black is not a rhinestone. It is a resin drill. It does have a silver backing, but it makes the painting pop. But that's, that, that's a lot. Two huge bags. I mean, oh my gosh, look at these colors. I think some of my favorites, though, have to be this one look at that blue oh my god do i love that one <gasps> and i love me some like teals look at those teals oh oh i just love these and we have so we have a little bit of the pink and the brighter pink so we do have a few little pinks and we have a little bit of clear but most of it is oh now that's a pretty that I thought it was green at first, but it's not. It's another teal. Oh my gosh. There's a lot. There's like one, two, three, four, five bags of a teal color. Oh, is there some purple? Yep. Yep. We got us some purple in here too. Oh my gosh. So this is going to be so beautiful. All right. Let me get this cleared up and we'll look at the picture one more time before we go on to our next one. Okay, I just want it to look at him one more time before we go on to the next one. So this one is what I am calling my ice dragon. I don't remember if it, like what name they had on um, the site for this one, but uh, I am just, I am so, so in love. And by the way, guys, when you see um, like these right here, this is just in the plastic. It is not in the canvas at all okay it's not in the glue it's it's not going to mess up because like i said this is poured glue so it's just the plastic okay and you can just you can take it and smooth it down and all that but is he not beautiful okay so let me get this one cleared up and let's look at our fire one so this one was our ice this one was our blue ice one now let's go look at the fire okay i'm back so now for our fire now you figured out that th that first one was a dragon. So I said they had something in common. And so you pretty much guarantee that this one's a dragon too. Uh, if you're new to my channel, I absolutely love dragons. Um, they are my thing. I love fairies, fantasy. I mean, I actually like a lot of different things. Um, but dragons, they're, they're like my spirit animal. I just, I absolutely am in love with them all right so i'm gonna i'm gonna 
get the drills out. This one's a big boy too. Goodness gracious, I didn't realize they were so large. Okay, now I want to kind of point this out. So this one has a different toolkit. Look at this. So this one comes with a square boat. And one of the cool things about this square boat, um, if you've never seen one of these, and this is the only company that I've seen them from, it has where one side, and um, you're not really going to be able to see it that well, but this, um, it, it says 2.5 millimeter on this side, which is the size of your squares. And the other side is a 2.8 millimeters for your rounds. Is that not awesome? And it's so that whatever size that you're working with, you know, you just turn it to that side and shake it. I think that is amazing. Um, and I, I always look forward to being able to get the little square boats if I can get the chance. So yay, I'm glad I got that one. Okay, so I'm going to roll this one the other way so that we can see our fire dragon. Okay. Are y'all ready? I'm so ready. Here we go. Oh, look at him. Now, see, this one goes this way. Oh, my goodness. Okay, so I'm going to try to see if I, can, if I can show you around here. So, here we have, here's his head. And I think he's standing, like, on this rock. See, like, here's his talons and all that. Oh, my gosh. And he's breathing fire. And I believe this is a castle right here. So this one is my fire dragon. Now this one, does it have dimensions on it? Yes, okay. So this one is a 40 by 80. And this one has 33 colors. And I forgot to mention in the other one, um, these numbers here are not DMC codes. These are acrylic diamond codes, okay? So, for your rhinestones and all. And so, once again, we have, okay, so we have numbers and letters, but then we also have four symbols. Let me see if I can get you closer. Okay, so our four symbols, we've got a plus, a less than sign, equal, and question mark. So, I mean, that's not real bad. Let me look and see if there's any letters that are going to cause an issue. Nope. Nope. None of these letters or numbers are going to cause any issue whatsoever. All right. So let's get into the drill field real quick and take a look. So let's bring you down to the drill field. Okay. So you can see this one is a little different. Um, do you see how you can actually see the circles right here? Okay, um, and so this one, at least here, like you can see that um, this has this white circle right there. So you will need to make sure that when you're putting down your rhinestones, you want to put them right on there because you don't want that white showing up because I'm imagining that it's, because let's see, what number is that? That's the number one. And number one is a red, okay? It's a red rhinestone. And so you just, you don't want that white showing. And when we look at, but see, when we look at these lighter colors, there's still a white circle, but you don't have a black outline around it, okay? So that's good. That's really good. Just the one thing you want to watch out for, like I said, is just make sure that you're covering up that white so it doesn't show through. But, I mean... I can see these symbols really well. I mean, I don't, I don't see any, I don't see any issues. I don't see any blurriness. It is sticky. All right, so let me bring you back up. Okay, so I don't really want to take these drills out, but we can kind of see here we've got oranges and reds. We've got some browns, yellows. So this is going to have a lot of red, yellow stuff, but. We obviously have black. Now, these black drills, these black resin ones, don't have the silver backing. So, I find that interesting. But, we do have a lot of that black resin because there's going to be a lot of black in there. Oh, and there's a red. So, I think this is going to be really, really fun. And, I do love how these are in the pre-kitted bags. The reason I like this is that now that I have a bag sorter, um, I can just take these out here 
I can leave them in the bags. And what I do, and I'll just go ahead, I'll take one out to show you if the bag will let me get into it. Okay, we're going to Crinkle Town for just a second. Okay, let's see. Okay, and I also want to show you something because this happens a lot with pre-bagged items. Um, okay, if you can see, there is a drill. There's some drills right here. Whenever they bag these up, what happens is sometimes some of them get stuck up here. All you have to do is open the bag a little bit. You just push it over and push those drills right back in. Not a problem. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put a little sticker on here that is the symbol because I diamond paint with my symbols. I don't diamond paint by this number. I diamond paint with the symbols. So I'll just put the symbol on the bag and then put this in my bag holder and diamond paint that way. Um, it's just, it's easier for me personally. Um, and so that's how I do it. But oh my gosh, y'all seriously, look at this black. Look how Okay, so obviously both of these I am going to be in in black heaven. I am going to be loving it. All right, so, oh, see, look, we got some hanging out at the top here. Come on, come on, get in there with your buddies. No, did, did, I told you, get inside with your buddy. No, get, stop being stubborn. Get in there. Thank you. See, sometimes they just want to act stubborn. I don't know what it is, but they are, mm, they's acting crazy. Okay, so let's look at this one one more time. I guess it would help if I don't have you upside down, huh? <laughs> oh. Now, see, I like this one. This one is not what I would consult, consider, like, just, like, beautiful. See, like, the other one, very beautiful face. This one is more fierce, right? This one is a fierce dragon. And I was really interested to see how this image looked in crystals. So I cannot wait to be able to start this one and show you guys what these look like in crystal rhinestones because I love me some crystal kits and I love this company. Amy from crystalcanvas.us. She is amazing. She has amazing things on her site. In fact, there's a couple of canvases that I have. I keep stalking the site to see if these canvases come back in stock because if they do I am going to get them I have more canvases from her that I will be unboxing and showing you I just want to make sure that I have nails that I enjoy because uh, if you are new to my channel I do like to try to take and match nails to the canvas um, just because it's kind of fun um, I, I enjoy it it's my little creativity way but oh i am so happy with my dragon paintings i've got me some more babies that are gonna I, like at this point i'm gonna be wallpapering my entire craft room and possibly my house at this point with my dragon paintings but you know what i don't care i just love them i just love having them okay so oh, i just can't believe i gotta put him up for a little bit because i'm working on four canvases right now and i can't work on either one of these yet but oh it will be soon 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 i'll get to you i promise okay so i hope that you like this video and if you did please hit that thumbs up button down below i'd really appreciate it and if you haven't subscribed to my channel i would love for you to subscribe and become part of the diamonds family you're all welcome here but if you do just make sure you hit that bell notification because that's going to let you know any time that i upload a video or whenever I go live. I usually go live on Mondays uh, at 7 o'clock Central Time. Um, and as far as uploads, I'm, I'm going to try to get more and more out there. Um, I'm sure you see shadows and everything. It's easier for me to film at night um, and then upload the next morning because um, it's, it's a little bit quieter in my house um, <laughs> during the nighttime. But I really hope that you've enjoyed this, and I'm going to leave you like I always do. Reach for the stars, grab hold, hold on, and never let go. Until my next video, bye guys.